are you thinking of relocating to the uk are you planning on doing that in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys the advantages and disadvantages of using agent and also i'm going to be sharing with you guys the easiest routes to relocate here with your family you'll be living your good life catch a glimpse from the outside then you see me now see me now see now hi guys welcome back again to my youtube channel if today is your first time here my name is stella if you've not subscribed to my channel please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and if you're a returning subscriber Thank you for coming by. Thank you for supporting your girl. I really appreciate you guys are the real G. And if you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. So in today's video, like I titled, I'm going to be sharing with you guys advantage and disadvantage. <laughs> Advantages and disadvantages of using agent. And I'm also going to be sharing with you guys the easiest route to relocate to the UK. And I'll be sharing with you guys the way or the honest truth on how i came here to the uk if this video looks like what you're going to like sit tight watch from the beginning to the end and don't forget to like subscribe and share and please ignore the background noise and yeah i can see you've seen my daughter say i just have to make this video because i wanted to make this video when she was sleeping and i was sneaky and boom she woke up and i don't know when i'll make this video again so just manage it so guys, like I said, the easiest way to come to this country and this UK, the easiest route is studies. So if you don't like school or you don't want to go for PhD, just go for your master. Generally, you will come in with your wife and children, you come in with your family. That's the easiest way. And like I said, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my own personal experience, how I came to this country. And yeah, either studies or work. And like I said, I love the work visa, to be honest. It's year two visa and I think it's one of the best visa. And with what's happening now, they're recruiting uh, healthcare workers, truck drivers. Drivers. there's so many job opportunities at the moment here in the uk like if you start their website me if you know what you're doing i think you'll get the job i'm telling you sure job is for you like you just need all you need to, is your time settle down make research check watch videos so you see videos that also drop links eh? so the main thing is just your time so these two things study or work that is the easiest way that's the easiest route and the uk like i said this country they too like money once you have your money come in for masters or you don't be for you and yeah i'm gonna show you guys how i came to this country i came in to study not me basically we came in based on study <laughs> my husband yeah my husband did his master he's here and yes this is now the reason why i'm going to be sharing with you guys advantage and disadvantage of using agent when we came in to be honest we used agents and my agent was really a nice person she's a nice lady and this lady worked hand in hand with the university of Huddersfield here in west yorkshire so um there's so many things we did not even know about so many things that i would not really know she was the one that was putting us through do this one do that one and the reason why i'm making this video is because of people asking me questions that say agent say this one agent say that one my dear there's some things that agents will tell you oh my if you sit down think you'll be like ah this is no you know it no blend well i don't think this is for real you know so yeah this agent to be honest she's a lovely lady and yeah i've been referring lots of people to her but the problem i'm having at the moment is that she's angry with me because my people i'm a nigerian i'm from nigeria and me, this my nigerian people don't understand that abroad is not nigeria they will now be chatting her please can i get school of 1.5 is she the owner of the school i is she the owner of abroad or is she the owner of uk is she boris johnson so she's really pissed like and the reason why i give people her contact is because when people dm me I'm, i get tired like i'll be like okay t i don't want people to think like see i'm hiding anything in this country so i'll just give them the agent number but she's so upset because some of them are not financially I don't know how to put it but you know i know they want to leave the country but it's not easy i think you need to relax save up you know and like i say if you're doing well just stay in your country anyway let me continue what i'm saying so we came in via study and yeah this lady did most of the things for us so sometimes my husband did not know she'll put her through she'll put him through and you know like based on say like the account statement and all of that so if you are not using agents you will not know some things so now that one of the advantages of using the agents they'll put you through they'll tell you how things work and all of that number two is like usually like nigerians we used to have a scholarship let's say if their school fees is 15k like 15 grand fifteen thousand pounds so usually government i don't know how they do it but sure governments we pay like four thousand scholarships something something i don't know how they do it but there's always that four thousand scholarship four thousand pound scholarship then that means they will now deduct four thousand pounds from your school fees 
that's how a nigerian government to pay for scholarship me i don't know how that works but yes they do it you see so if you don't use agents i don't know if you're going to know or how you work i don't know if you know how they you do it so with agency instead of you paying fifteen thousand pounds the money will reduce that's it but if you don't use agency you will not know and number three with agency sometimes they will even connect you with someone in that particular school like when we when we came here eh? Well, we did not really, she did not really connect up with anybody. We came and hustled our thing by ourselves. But most people now coming in, she will be the one. She'll be like, Stella, please, I have this lady coming. Can you help me? You know, she'll talk to me. I'll be like, ah, God, no, Allah. Okay, I'm off. So they let this person. I don't know. I'll tell her that. Okay, I don't mind. If this person is coming, maybe on Tuesday, I'm, I'm not working that day. I'll, you know, welcome the person, help the person, look for accommodation, buy things for this person. As in for free, or me, I don't even use to charge this, pay me for anything. Mm -mm, just willingly, I'll just do it. So if you're using agents, you know, some agents will help you with all of these things. And you don't even, you that don't know a country, the agents will now like link you up with some good people. Yeah, that's another advantage of using agents. So, and this advantage of using agency. Some agents are criminals. I don't blame them that they're hungry. But in some ways, I still blame our own people because I don't understand how agents will tell you that I'll look for a school or I'll look for a job for you. But you have to pay me one million. Ah, one million for what? Why am I paying you one million? One million. Are you the owner of UK? Why will I pay you one million to get me a job? When you serve yourself, you can search for the job yourself, email the people, and obviously they will call you on Zoom, interview you, ask you questions. You know, with things happening now, but now you see people paying agents. That's how one of my friends called me and told me that uh, uh, somebody said that he can come to UK, that his friend said that they should deposit three million, they work papers for him to come to the UK. I said three million to work papers for you to come to the UK. And I said, where is the person? He said the person is in London. Three million for what? He said he's, the person is coming for starting for business. I said three million. You want to use three million to do business here in the UK with which company or with which people in London? You want to use three million? That all everybody in Nigeria, even my father, would not give the person three million for them to start a business. You see, there's some things that if they tell you and you check it it's not like the story is not it's not just going flowing well how will your friend tell you okay bring one million we'll find one school for you we'll find a job for you all these things are just my people to be honest like i'm saying this because of somebody her experience was really bad and i told her that you, you see all these things you need to like relax this abroad you know they rush them you go reach everybody you know you just have to relax no rush in life all this one million five hundred k sometimes they say you bring five hundred for what even this agent um if you're coming to study and uh, if an agent say you have to pay the person one million for what to be honest normally agents are not even supposed to be collecting money from their clients because the school will compensate them they'll give them some certain percent of each you know student they bring but usually some agents will just charge 50k for you know for the unknown part now this most month in some charge hundred thousand like i said i'm using naira because i'm nigerian so some of them will be using two hundred thousand hundred fifty k but anyone that is from 500k me i don't understand if the person an agent or the person want to rob you because at least agent to charge you is 100k for like i don't even know just for them to charge side money for them to hold for themselves that's just because the school will give them something i don't know if you get understand what i'm saying so you coming in here saying i, I regret using agent blah blah but some people be asking me questions asking me and me i will even get tired i'll tell them me i'm not agent you see these things you have to meet the genuine agent like i said my own agent is angry Telling me if this person is not ready, I should not give anybody her number. Because you guys will now be prizing school. School that is not have her own. She that she have not even seen the school yet. You will be prizing school. Please, can I get school of one million naira? One two million naira. You see the sense. And then yes, the ones that the agents that are hungry will tell you, yes, we'll get you school of one million naira. Pay the money into our account. Obviously. What do you expect? They need the money and they use the money to sort out their own problems. Please, sorry for the background noise, my daughter. So I'm just sharing with you guys that you have to be very smart. This abroad thing no be anything like UK or Canada or America or Germany no be uh, what's it called? Dubai. Dubai is almost people go to Dubai and say, I want to I want to live in Nigeria, let me go to Dubai, let me go to India. My people, why will you be traveling to India, Dubai? I could remember. I remember a friend of mine that was trying, just working hard 
for her sister to come from Cyprus because the sister is in Cyprus and she's suffering all in the name of her to live abroad. Me, I've not been to Cyprus before, but she was just saying that is it Cyprus? Yeah, I think it's Cyprus that is language, they speak language, and there's no job, nothing. She was just she's not happy, like she's so so sad. Me, I've not been to Cyprus before, but some people there are still okay, some people there are still doing well. But I don't think me, I will, as a person, I want to even go to Cyprus to be honest. But like I said. You have to make good research for me i find it difficult to learn language so that's why i find it difficult to go to like a speaking no a language speaking country like germany i know some people are blending well spain people are living well but for me as a person to be honest it will be, be so difficult for me because before i start learning the language and i'm a very slow learner so how will i even learn the language how will i so i rather go to any country they speak, that speak english i beg or oh, my park say my country the, as it is now, I can only go there to visit. I can go to Spain to visit, holiday, Germany to go holiday, um, po is it Portugal? I think they speak language there. So holiday, you know, stuff like that. But people are doing well there. People are doing well there. But you can't spend your money going to India. Why will you be going to India or go to Dubai? I know people, I'm a, work in Dubai itself, you have to be real professional. Low. But like I said, here in the UK, it's not as if it's that wow but as bad as it bad you not be hungry i don't know if you understand and going to saudi arabia i don't understand some people and they will go there and suffer agent will tell you that i would make paper for you to come to uk to work my people you have to be smart though you have to be smart this video is like i see i'm ranting but yes i'm just making this video based on all the call phone calls and talk 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 that i've been receiving yeah but I believe that this video is going to help someone and I believe that this video is going to educate some of us. Yeah, I know I'm ranting, but I feel like this video is going to help somebody. And if you have anything you want to add to this video, please add in the comment section and let's help some people. Let's just be smart. Don't go about paying any agency money for this one, money for that one. You can also make research yourself online, ask questions online, watch YouTube video, check Google. You know, you can do things yourself. And yes it's good for you to use agent that's my own opinion it's good for you to use agent because some of these agents are good that's why you have to make good research in using your own agent and if you find this video useful or you watch this video to this very end you guys are the real g and i'll see you guys in my next video i hope you enjoyed this video bye guys Softly spoken.